that how you have your game set up to play is somehow not optimized. Whether it be the cables you're using, the type of TV you're using, or yikes, stretching games to widescreen. I can't tell you how many times I've seen somebody share a picture of them playing a game only to get destroyed in the comments for playing their older games in widescreen. Stand up. Put your legs off. I'm gonna take this tip. When all they were trying to do was share a post about how much fun they're having playing a game. That's like when people tell me I'm opening my bananas from the wrong end. From either end, I hear this criticism. So you know what? Get heck with all of ya. When all they were trying to do was share a post about how much fun they're having playing a game. Just it's like when people tell me I'm opening my bananas from the wrong end. From either end, I hear this criticism. So you know what? Get heck with cool. all of ya. If more modern games that are clearly catered Aren't you here to take care of me? Gamers. Stuff like uh, Shovel Knight, Sonic Mania, but those are specifically targeting the retro demographic. What's different about Fall Guys is that it's targeting everybody. In fact, some people are predicting it to be as successful as Fortnite. Now, maybe you like something like Fortnite, but a lot of people are sick of its popularity. And more than that, people are sick of, you know, first-person shooters and third-person shooters being such a dominant popular oh. genre. And here's the thing about Fall Guys. In a lot of ways, it's essentially a platformer. And what could be a more retro gaming genre than a platformer? Just, just, so what just, is Fall Guys if you don't already know? Well, it's this game where you start off as 60 of these Fall Guys. And what Fall Guys are are essentially these cute little chubby bean-shaped guys. And you can dress them up all these different ways. In fact, a lot of sponsors have already gotten on board with this because they see it as a huge marketing potential. I'm telling you, this game could be the next big thing. Maybe it'll fall flat on its face, you never know, but it has all the makings of the next big thing. So each game starts out with 60 of these different Fall Guys, and it's 60 different people all online playing. And basically, you make your way through stages, and every round, people get eliminated. And so, eventually, you go from 60 all the way down to 1. The 